Retransmission, Segment 3, Acquiring Contemporaneity. It has been 95 days since the Great Catastrophe. The Messenger Speaks. You must be wondering why I have reached out to you. It was written, you see, that you would come to this particular chamber at this very moment in time. The walls told us of your coming when we once were. Look at them. Are they not fascinating? One of your... These walls tell of a tragic story, a story we transcribed on our structures, on our artifacts, a story we cannot alter, a mystery defying us in plain sight. We tried. Our scholars and scientists, poets and physicists, bright minds, rebellious hearts, They all tried so hard to bring about change. They, we all failed. None could change what we discovered, the stories written into the walls of these rooms. By whom, we never knew. We know they tell of the future that is, the future that was, and the future that is yet to come. We failed at modifying the line. We failed at adding a single dot. It was clear we were to be messengers at best. But messengers to whom? To you. We removed our ability to read those stories from your original template. A doorway that is also a puzzle. We must find a solution. Those were Brutus's words when he visited the vault under the Colosseum more than 2,000 years ago. He drew the vault, sketched it to the best of his abilities, but he could not see. Just as you are blind, you may read your watch, you may read hourglasses and calendars, but you cannot grasp beyond that simplistic surface. For now, the true reading of time still escapes you. And so today, the curtains pulled and the earth is shown, tragic and complete. Those walls you might never read. Events yet unfold as written, but something Anything must change. You do not understand what is at stake. The reader has no power. He is but an observer. But the author? The author invents the future. The author owns the future. A future where zeros are avoided. A future where a loved one can be revived by the drafting of a new chapter. A future where humankind is more than it is today. A future where, just perhaps, we can all still exist together.
Attack! 